What's up guys, it's me your boy Steve Ram here and I am back with my sister Marianne. Would you like to say hello? Hi, hello uh, everyone. Today we're going to be smelling the top 10 fragrances for men mm -hmm. and I'm going to get my sister's opinion on them and let's get rolling. So we're going to start with one, wait don't look, we're going to start with, okay. Can I just say something? What? If I really really like the fragrance, I'm just going to give it a heart and that okay. means 10 out of 10. Okay. We're going to start right. off with the one you guys saw. I'm not going to tell my sister anything and if she likes it, she likes it, doesn't like it, move on, you know. Alright, All right, let's the start. There's the first one. Yeah. Mmm. I like it. it. The first word that came to my mind was strength. It smells confidence, strength. I would give it out of 10, uh, 7.8. 7.8. 7.8 out of 10. And would you... um? See us for like a teenager? Um, no, this is more like the college See. type of age. So like like 20-ish, 20 20-ish uh -huh. and over. Alright, uh, yeah. so you gave it, what do you give it? 7.8. Alright, this yeah. is Versace de Lune Blue. Have you okay. seen this one? No, I'm yeah. not that familiar with the men's fragrances, so it's all new it's to all me. It's alright though, yeah. yeah, as long as you know, just Honest opinion, and that's it. Um, that's it. <laughs> Honesty. <laughs> Alright, so that was uh, kind of a medium fragrance, not too big. Mm -hmm. But now we're going to move on to this fragrance right here. Alright. Mm, this is very different than the first one I smelled. It's, it's very uh, fresh and light. It's not that strong, so it's a medium type of strength to it. You think it's for teenagers as well? Yeah, this I would I would say it's, it suits more teenagers um, okay. when, like, I don't know. It's just, I honestly don't think that teenagers need strong fragrances, so I would yes. recommend this one. So how would you rate it out of 10? Um, 7.5. <clears throat> 7.5. Mm -hmm. 7.5. And this is Invictus Aqua. Oh. The, no, the Invictus is okay. what you smelled last time. <laughs> oh, um, this is Aqua, right? Yeah, no is, wonder it's got that this is warm, more like, like fresh, a, uh, the fresh yeah, taste to it's it. It's more of a mm -hmm. lemon addition to it. Okay. Yeah, yeah that's good to know. Right. That's a lot of sprays. Yeah. Spray. <laughs> But don't look at the camera. Oh. How do you know if it's like really expensive or not? Because since you're spraying a lot of... We could do sprays. a video on that. I mean, it could tell us if it's more expensive or not. Oh, this one is very different than the first two. No, I didn't like this one. You don't like this one? No. It's, is it too um, dark? Or? I, it's just too bold. Uh, okay. So, so it's how much you rate it up? up to? Uh, to be fair... I'm gonna give it a four out of ten. Okay. No, it's but it's alright to zero, be. So it's it's alright to be. No, it's alright to be like a one out of ten. I mean, it's um, all your. It doesn't have can, to be. Can I smell it again? Yeah. Just to double check. Yeah. No, it's still a four out of ten. <laughs> Is that the the like? So far, it's the least. Yeah. Okay. It's the least. Sorry, guys. It's just that I'm super oh, so honest. It's so, so yeah. It's alright. I'm wasting a lot of sprays, but at least you guys are getting. You guys, he's he's doing the job. So what do you think about this one? Mm. All right. You can. By the way, you can look at this way because I I don't have the fragrance on. Um, I'm not holding it. I don't know. This one got me really thinking about it because it's not that strong and it's not that light. It's not that bold. But it's, it's got middle, this. Yeah, it's it's in the middle and it's got this um, sweet touch to it. It's like uh, I think it's amber in there. It's, Probably. It as amber. Yeah, probably that's what I'm smelling. But I would recommend this if you're not into the strong fragrances. So this is something that you might want to think about. I would give it a, a 7.5. 7.5. So they've all been in that seven range, decent, except for <laughs> except um, for the four. Lan weed alone. So this is a seven. You said 7.5. Right. Mm -hmm. That was Dolce Gabbana, the one. Oh, one. yeah. So we just took a little break guys and now we're back for the rest of the And I did not coin. see anything. Yeah. So pure honesty <laughs> over here. I mean but still like some of them you don't recognize, so I uh, yeah, like I said, I'm not really a familiar person with men's fragrances, so this is all new to me and I'm really just being on the spot over here, so mm -hmm. on the top over there. <coughs> It's strong and it's bold and I didn't like it. 
Yeah, no, it's not my taste. It's definitely not something that I would like or so, recommend. Well, like, what do you what do you not like about it? But don't or, get me wrong. So. Maybe men will like to put this on, and other girls may like it, but not not yeah, pers you're not personally. Opinion. So it's just it's just my opinion. It yeah. doesn't mean like I'm the super talented person that knows what fragrances. So how would you rate it? Out of 10? This one would be a 5 out of 10. So slightly better than the other. Yeah, five. than the other 4. Okay, so and this was four. Dior Homme Intense. Not the Parfum version, just the Intense version. Mm -hmm. And yeah, this is more of a uh, slightly older, you know, more masculine. Classic? Kind of yeah, it's kind of classic too. Right. We've got about 5 fragrances left. Okay. So let's see what you like about this one. Or what you don't like about this one. Here you go. Mmm. This one's very light, but I really like it. It's um, a daydreaming sort of uh, fragrance. I must say it's got that feminine touch to it. It's I, I feel like it's good during the day because it's got that light freshness to it. So, so it's not it's, strong for you? It's, it's Yeah, no, it's not strong. Okay. It's light and I like this one. Yeah. How much is it? Of 10? This one, this one would be a um, 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. So, so far it's been the highest. And this is um, Valentino Uomo Intense. Okay. And the weird thing is that people compare this one to the last one you smell. Oh, okay. Your own Intense. They compare yeah. it to oh. each other because they have, they both have iris in them. Oh, okay. So, do you, wait, do you want to just smell? Yeah, let's recap Dior on Ohm. that. Just, this is Dior Om Intense and this is... Valentino There's the one Uomo. I just now smelled. No, no that's, that's Valentino. Okay. Yeah, they yeah similar. they're 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 similar, definitely. Oh my gosh, they're so similar, and I didn't <laughs> notice that, but I like this one better. So you like Valentino? Valentino. Mm -hmm. All right. Here you go. All right. Mmm, minty. Minty? Yeah, that's that's on there. Yeah, like a mintish, lemonish type of taste to it, so but good. I didn't like it. No. You don't like it? <laughs> no, I'm sorry, I don't. No, it's it's all right. It's completely all right. All right. No one's gonna get offended. What do you what do you like not like about? It? Is it too dark it's, or? No, it's just like it's it's like it came from back from the death or something. It's like it's dead. So it's like um, dull kind of. Like, yeah, it's like dull. it's dull. It's dead. Even though it's got that mint and lemon to it, but it still it doesn't smell like it's fresh and I'm missing that. So I was looking for something more fresh and it just, it wasn't there. Okay, how much do you rate it out of 10? 5.5. 5.5, mm -hmm. all right. This was Aqua Di Gio Perfumo. This is like more of a darker version of the Aqua Di Gio. Oh, okay. You've probably seen the other yeah, one. Yeah. That was a very popular fragrance back in the days. And it still is, but this one's kind of mm -hmm. the other kind of brother that's taken over. Oh, okay. Yeah, 5.5, uh, so so far this, I think the last time you smelt the other fragrances, they were better, but... I Invictus, still remember the one I liked, yes, Invictus. Invictus. Yeah. That's my favorite right, so far. So, <laughs> well, I'm still waiting to give the heart to someone. Yeah. So I'm still waiting to, you know, a give to give a 10 out of 10, but so far, there's nothing. Right. This one, what do you think about this one? Mm -hmm. This is also the type that you could wear during the day. So it's a daylight type of uh, fragrance. Yeah. I really like that it's light and it's fresh. It's got that wildness to it, but it, in a good way. Like it's not a nightlife type of uh, fragrance, so. Okay, this is uh, like, is it like? It's really fresh. It's really fresh. And yeah, like it gives you this good vibe to it. Do you There's get a slight spiciness vibe. or no? No, or like not pepper, really. Pepperness. No, but it's okay. it's good. At, it's it's definitely got a positive and a good vibe to it, and okay. that's what you normally want to wear, like something that attracts positivity and good. Yeah. Um, you know, good vibes. So, how, how much should you rate that one? Um, this one I would give it a nine, nine out of ten. Okay. So you gave this one a nine out of ten. Uh huh. Nine out of ten. Nine this out is of ten. Chanel Allure Om Sport O Extreme. This is a pretty new purchase for me, but I'm still. Kind of getting used to wearing it, so you like this one a lot, like nine out of ten. Not it... so far; it's been the highest yeah. out of this collection. Okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> Chanel Louis <laughs> Sport. <laughs> so far, they in a pack. All right. Um, we have two more fragrances to go. All right. And let's hope there is like a good ten out of ten. It would be see. a shame not to give the heart to someone. <laughs> well, I mean, if if you don't give any hearts, like for them, that's alright, cause it's just. 
It's basically what you think about them. They might not be good, they might be good. No? <laughs> I'm sorry. No, this one is pure dead. Like it's pure. honestly, it's like someone laying there and he's dead. Like it's it's dead. There's not a single freshness or light or dark or you know bold or strength it, or positivity uh, or any of the good vibes. Or I mean, no, there is there's no character in it. Right. It's trying. like it's it's lack of character, lack of confidence, lack of strength. You I'm, know, it's pure death. This one was would get a one out of ten. One out of yeah, ten. Yeah, no, this has been the lowest so That's, far. And I'm I can't wait to know what the per, what yeah, the you know fragrance what, what's is. What's odd about it? What? It's, uh, it's Dior Savage or the Parfum version. The, the, your survival. Oh, your the other type, right? But it's yeah. Just, oh my God, they're so like. Some what you think? Because you like yeah, the no, other one. I like the other one. Yeah, the I think other so. Yeah. Version. Yeah, I did. But this one is just I don't know. Like there, I could smell the fragrance. So it's just it's. So to I me, mean, it was pure. You just dead. don't like it. I mean, no, it's, I, all right. I didn't like it. Sorry. Some people, like you it. know, also don't like this. So, and the other toilet people prefer mm -hmm. more. I personally do prefer the auto toilet more as well. Okay. Yeah, you know you, <laughs> Steve. You've got good taste after all. So. all right. And this is the last one. All right. And... Fingers crossed. I might give the heart to it. All right. Here you go. Yeah. No, I don't know what's wrong with this collection. There's just these are all kind of uh, darker scents. I think. Right. Maybe I'm just you, not that might, type. I mean, I think right. you might like the more fresher. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Maybe that's why. But for some reason, I can smell uh, jasmine in this. I don't know why. Personally, it, I didn't like it. It's dark. Is it spicy? It's like a it's a muddy type of Sp uh, is it spicy you know or? fragrance. It you, gives you that feeling of mud. Is it spicy to you? Like spices or something? No. It's it's. it's it's weird though. It's it's muddy, and at the same time, it's got that jasmine, like feminine taste well, to it. Are you sure you're smelling the right fragrance? I mean, yes. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay. I see. I kind of see what you're seeing. Yeah. Say. So it's 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 weird. That's what I'm saying. It's it maybe may work for both like daylight and uh, during the night. So after during the nightlight. How much would you rate it out of ten? I don't think it's been the worst so far. So I well, would let's, let's just say your own with opinion. this one, right? With this specific one, I like the jasmine jasmine factor in it so i would rate it a seven out of ten seven. for the jasmine sake but i i, I didn't influence you though right? no there was okay. no influences i'm gonna give it a seven out of ten, seven out of ten. Mm -hmm. all right this is spice bomb by victor and ralph i don't know but i don't think they've listed which jasmine one's this one the spice bomb oh okay it's called spice bomb because it's like a bunch of spices oh into one maybe like that was like the muddy freshness. type of sensation that i got to it maybe so <laughs> far i think you've the two you've liked from this list have been which one was it? Chanel Allure on Sport O Extreme uh -huh. and Valentino Womo Intense. Uh, Those two I think you like the most. Invictus, this is for Invictus. you. <laughs> so far, Invictus has been my favorite out of the two, like both collections. Even though I didn't give a heart. To any of those fragrances in this video, but this is a heart to everyone. If we had that, that on the last video, you probably would have <laughs> yeah, given exactly. out hearts. But this is a heart to everyone that likes this video and to everyone that subscribes and to everyone who enjoyed this video. And yeah, is um, that, that's all. The, yeah. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you guys want to see my sister again for another video, let me know in the comments below. She does read the comments, so. I know, I do her. read the comments. Thank you all for those lovely comments. I appreciate your lovely opinion, and I hope to do more videos with you. And that's it. Nice way to end the video. <laughs> Peace.